today I'm going to be showing you guys some fall and autumn dog treats recipes and creating them with you guys so let's go ahead and get started don't forget to like comment and subscribe and turn on notification bell to get notified anytime I post a new video let's go ahead and jump right into today's video okay so for the first recipe I'm going to be making this quick and easy peanut butter dog treat recipe so what you'll need is two cups flour one half cup creamy peanut butter, two eggs, and one fourth cup water. So it's pretty easy ingredients. So I'm gonna go ahead and get all those ingredients out. And while you get your ingredients out, you can preheat your oven to 350 degrees. I am going to try to make cool shapes like pumpkins and different fall shapes like leaves and things. I'm not gonna make mine into stars. You can make whatever shapes you want. But let's go ahead and start getting out the ingredients. Also, it says that you can use different kind of peanut butter if you don't have the creamy peanut butter. But it might be a little bit harder to work into the dough. Just make that as a note. But if you do not have creamy peanut butter, you can use different kind if you want. Alright guys, so I have my eggs. All right, now I have my flour. And last but not least, the creamy peanut butter. All right, so the first three steps, number step one is preheat your oven to 350 degrees. Then we're gonna mix together our flour, peanut butter, and eggs into a large bowl. And then add a bit of water, approximately one tablespoon at a time. And then it will be wet enough to roll out as dough. So let's go ahead and combine the peanut butter, eggs, and flour. Okay, now I am pouring my first cup of flour into the bowl. And now I am pouring my second cup of flour into the bowl. Okay, now I have my one half cup of peanut butter and I'm going to go ahead and dump it into the bowl. All right, the peanut butter is in the bowl and I'm going to go ahead and do the eggs now. Okay, I have my first egg. And now I have my second egg. Now that I have all the ingredients inside the bowl, it says to mix together the flour, peanut butter, and eggs in the large bowl until slightly combined, and then add a little bit of water. So I'm going to go ahead and mix them and then add a little bit of water, which is a fourth cup of water, by the way. Here's my spoon, and I'm going to go ahead and mix. Okay, so the bowl is slightly combined, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take my fourth cup of water and pour it in, and then mix it all together again to create a dough-like mixture. And then we can get to the fun part of making the pumpkins and leaves in different patterns. Okay, so now that we have the dough, it is time to roll out the dough, which is the next step, and cut it out with your favorite shapes or some cookie cutters. All right, I have my huge chunk of dough and the rolling pin right here. I'm gonna go ahead and roll out the dough. Okay, so I have the dough rolled out and I'm gonna go ahead and make some patterns and put them on a cookie sheet now. Okay, so I made some pretty cool designs. I made a cat, a football, and a pumpkin. Tell me in the comments down below what designs you guys made. So this is all I could fit on the first tray. I do have some dough left. But now I'm going to go ahead and put them into the oven. All right, they're in the oven and then I'm going to go ahead and set my timer to 15 minutes. All right, and make sure you are set at 315. Mine was at 315 just a second ago, but I accidentally shut the oven off, but it will get up there again. 
right away, but they are in the oven. I'm gonna go ahead and keep doing different prints for more of them, and then I will show you when they come out. Okay guys, so the cookies are out. I think they look amazing. As you see, there is a football, and under there is a pumpkin and a little kitty cat. So let's go ahead and see if Little Bear likes them. First, we're going to let them cool out. I would let them cool for around five to 10 minutes, and then you can let your dog enjoy the delicious treat. Okay, so I'm gonna give Little Bear the cat, and he's already very interested. You like it? Puppy. I think he likes it a lot. He doesn't really know how to bite it quite yet. But I definitely enjoyed making these treats. If you guys would like to drop in the comments down below what designs you made and if your dog liked it or if you put in any special ingredients, that would be very interesting to hear. And thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up, subscribe, and comment down below, like I said, and turn on your notification bell to get notified anytime I post a new video. And thank you guys so much for watching.